it's Megan from Fashionably Thrifty and today I'm going to be showing you my April favorites. This whole year I feel like I've been really playing around with my style more than I really have in quite a while. I think that's definitely evident with some of the pieces I have here in my favorites so let's just get into this. Some of these things you'll have seen in my last haul such as these lace-up boots. I knew pretty much as soon as I got these that they would find themselves in a favorite video at some point. I've been wearing these so much since I first got them. Like I will have said in my haul video, it's kind of like they're almost like a fancier version of a combat boot. And I love my combat boots, but I also love my fancier shoes. So this is just the perfect combination. Easy to walk in, really comfortable, goes with practically everything. So these shoes are just a match made in heaven for me, really. <laughs> I got these at Dirt Cheap, which I will have talked about in my last haul, but if you didn't see that, I will link it, but also say that Dirt Cheap's kind of like a Ross, where it's stuff that is overstocked or hasn't sold at stores is, is brought there, but it's definitely like unorganized, but you can get some really great stuff for some really great discounts. So these shoes I got for $15. And they're from the brand A+. One of the other things I got at Dirt Cheap were these navy culottes. And I did not think I would like culottes, or culottes, whatever you call them. Um, I didn't think I'd like them on me anymore, but tried these on and really, really loved them. So I've been wearing them quite a bit. You'll have seen them in the haul and then also in my recent Outfits of the Week video. In fact, a lot of the stuff you'll have seen in my Outfits of the Week because it's been some of my most worn things. So they found themselves in that video. But yeah, these have just been really cool to experiment with. I've this whole year or so I've been really experimenting with different styles of pants, and this is just another style that I was able to try out and find out that I like. So hopefully I'll be able to find a black pair at some point. But these are originally from Old Navy and they were $4.50. Now moving on to a color that I've been wearing a lot of recently, and that is light blue, or baby blue if you call it that, or if you call it dusty blue, pastel blue, whatever you call it, I tend to call it light blue. It's one of my favorite colors of all time and I recently got some new stuff in it, like this dress. Again, you will have seen this in the haul and the outfits of the week video, but this is just one of my favorite dresses of all time now. I've only worn it to church so far, but I'd love to find like a casual way to wear this. Um, I really just need to experiment with this more because it's one of my favorite things. This I got at Plato's Closet and it's from the brand Trixie. And I think I got it for $8. Now this next thing is kind of cheating because it's not actually light blue. It's a light wash, but same difference. <laughs> you will have seen this in my January favorites, but I've never worn it more times than I have these past few months, especially this month. It just seems that denim jackets are the staple for almost every fashion blogger, but they never were for me. And then my best friend wears one like all the time and she looks great in it. So it was just inspiring me to want to wear this more and figure out more ways to style this. And I finally succeeded in wearing it a bunch and finding tons of different ways to style it that I'd never thought of before. So yeah, this is definitely a firm favorite for this whole year. And I think it's definitely becoming a staple in my wardrobe, which is so cool to say because I've never been able to say that about a denim jacket but now I think I can. <laughs> this one I thrifted, but it's from the brand Blastport, and I got it for $6, I think. I'll continue with another jacket, and that is my Black Bomber. This is a jacket that I absolutely adore, but I think I just basically forgot about it for a really long time. Like, I'd wear it very infrequently, because I got it, like, right at the beginning of summer last year, so I couldn't really wear it. <laughs> then and then once it became like fall and winter I just kind of forgot that I hadn't worn it a lot and so it just kind of got pushed aside not really worn a lot but this past few months I've been making an effort to wear this and then I've just been finding tons of outfits from like I need a black jacket which jacket looks the best oh the black bomber actually looks the best also I've been really loving experimenting with all my silver jewelry and so I love having a jacket with silver accents so I've also been wearing my leather jackets quite a bit but this is what I decided to shine the spotlight on because I finally remembered that I have this and have been wearing it quite a bit and again you will have seen it in outfits of the week this one I thrifted as well and I think it was six dollars as well it's from the brand Delia I think De Delia Delia I don't know how to pronounce that but it was from the thrift store, so who cares? 
And lastly is something I am shocked to put in my favorites, but I am so happy to put on my favorites. And I have only shown these in the outfits of the week so far. I haven't shown it in any kind of haul or anything um, because they were thrifted and I haven't done a thrift haul in a while, but I'll probably put it in whatever next one I do because I love these so much. They are these black sneakers. The only sneakers I wear are Converse, but I've been wanting to wear other kinds, but I could never find them. And finally, one time when I was at the thrift store, I found these, and I really ummed and ahred over them for a while. Is that how you say it? Um, ummed and ahred? I, I only hear British people say that, so I feel like I'm saying the wrong thing when I say it. <laughs> anyway, that was really off topic. Moving on. I was kind of debating getting them, especially because I couldn't really see how they looked like on because they were hooked together. Um, but I finally was like, okay, I'll get them. They're four dollars. I've worn these so much this month. I only started wearing them this month, even though I got them, I think, at the beginning of March. I just couldn't figure out how to style them a lot, and then finally I was like, I'm gonna make the effort to figure out how to style them, and now I've been wearing them, like, all the time. <laughs> They're from the brand Aerovon, I think, but anyway, I looked them up, and they were originally like a hundred and forty or fifty dollars because they are real suede but I got them for four dollars even though they are quite worn but I should stop ranting about these because I do want to put these in a haul sometime. So that was it for my April favorites. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, this is definitely some of my favorite pieces I've ever put together for a favorites video which is really surprising because most of them are pretty different to my usual style but I, I really have been wearing all of these just a ton, a ton, a ton. So I'll see you guys next week for a new video. Bye!